guys, welcome back to Twitchy Plays XCOM Enemy Unknown and the quest for two bits of Illyrium. I mean, oh my, this has been going on, well, this quest for two bits of Illyrium has been going on for three, maybe four episodes now. I don't know if this is the third or fourth. And oh my gosh, this is just really, like, I can, I can smell the end game. The temple ship is right there. It is on the very tip of my tongue. All I just need to do is be able to use this ethereal device. But with that little bit of a rant over, should we uh, get on and just, just see what else is going to happen here? Now, this request from Asia, we're just going to let fly by because we don't need uh, need to fill it. They wanted plasma rifles, so you know, that was that was rubbish. You know, plasma rifles need illyrium. It's ah, terrible. Uh, what was that, that um, achievement I just got there? I have no idea. But we, we've got an A grade again, as we normally do. Our money is through the roof, as it has been since we started doing this whole we need Lyrium business because I cannot spend my money anywhere now my, like I, I think maybe there is hang about let's have, let's have a look over here in the uh, officer training school no like we don't need the new guy like that we are one mission away from the end game like oh look we got someone who needs some uh, some leveling up here this of course is our support officer that we won last time uh, we don't want to oh, yeah let's do the loadout oh no no Titan armor for them here but let's uh Equip them out with the best stuff we can. Now, this as a support officer, obviously they're going to need a medikit. But I've got a feeling they're probably going to get more stuff from this. So obviously the smoke grenade. Uh, we want to give them sprinter every time. We want to give them sm sprinter. Um, field medic or smoke and mirrors. I think we're going to go for field medic, even though we never really use that many medikits, which is strange. It's possibly why we've lost so many people at once. Um, I like this revive thing. The much better than the rifle suppression. Much better than the rifle suppression. And then dense smoke as opposed to combat drugs. Now, I've always gone for combat drugs just because this, this seems quite good. And it gives me a, a boost to my will. I didn't know that. I didn't realise that. This make, that makes my uh, my psionic attacks a lot more powerful. Perhaps we'll go with that. Though this guy is probably never going to come out with us. Probably never going to come out with us. Okay, that, that was the weird little bits that we had to do sort of around the base. And we're just waiting, just waiting for another UFO contact. That'd be great. Another UFO contact would be, like, super awesome. Brilliant. It's exactly what we want. It's a scout target, which means we can take it down relatively easy. Uh, no idea what's on board, but we are going to start... Should we start with the heavies? Let's, let's just send that in there and, and finish it off. Uh, normally, we send one of the small interceptors first. Uh, this is uh, just in case it gets blown up or something. We make a bit of a dent, and then we can come in with, the, the, with this uh, firestorm. But I think we should be... I mean, look at this. Oh, what? what? What's going on? Oh, wow, one shot. I was like, hey, why are we getting shot so often? This is rubbish. And then one shot, bam. Done for. Okay, we've got six crew in there. Six crew. This this should be a bit of a walkover. <laughs> I wonder what's going to be du be doubled. Like, uh, uh, the one, two, three, four, five. There's going to be something there that's two, and then everything else is going to be one of each. I reckon we're going to have two floaters. That's, that, that's my prediction. That's my prediction. Okay, so let's have a look here. Has our sniper sorted his stuff out? Because I would really like to take two... Yes, he has. Good. I would, I'd really like to have two snipers on board. I always think it's kind of the best thing to do, especially in these small missions like this. You just have a guy sat at the back going... Pew, pew, pew. Okay, so sending the Sky Ranger out and doing our thing. All the way from Europe to the USA. Here is quite a long flight. It's been a while since I've done that flight myself. I was about eight last time. Okay, let's let's go and have a look, shall we? Let's go and have a look. We are in the middle of nowhere, as we always are when we bring down a UFO. Uh, a little bit vexing, as as you guys know, I prefer solid walls so we can walk along them and stuff like that. Not that I ever actually walk along solid walls. I end up going from like wall to wall. Um, but you know, it, it's nice to have that. Um, the, the main thing with walls is normally there's a corner, which means that there's another wall somewhere else. Okay, we are in position to engage. Alright, so let's move this guy up here. Obviously a sniper up the front is the best thing. Okay, I'm going to throw this. Is that the furthest we can throw it? Let's throw it there. Let's see what happens. We might might see some people to worry about, we might not. Um, oh, look, it's just stuck on a rock up there. I was kind of hoping it'd roll a bit further forwards than that. Uh, if not roll, at least, you know, get get thrown, bounced, bob along, stuff like that. Uh, make sure I'm not going in the wrong direction. There's a, there's an edge of map. Uh, I think this is an edge of map, obviously, because it's a Sky Ranger. And then the other edge of map is a long way away over this way. Okay, well, I don't know. Let, let's just 
Let's just roll our way up this way, see what we see. Uh, Kix is going to come over this way. We're just going to start our first turn deployment. Now, one thing that I have learned recently Overwatch. is the quick key for Overwatch. I, I wish I'd known that so long ago. Oh, my God. And frankly, I'm going to blame you lot for not letting me know. I mean, oh. <laughs> I mean, it couldn't be my fault for not looking up stuff. I mean, what, what, why, would that, why would that be a thing? Uh, what else are we going to do? So we've got Matsumoto. He is our support officer. Obviously, he takes up the most rearward position. Because um, we need him to be safe. Like, super safe. Okay, and now what have we got here? Wild Child blatantly wants to be up front with kicks. Um, we're going to kind of move up this sort of this sort of line here. Uh, and then finally, we have our other sniper, who might just sit on Overwatch in case something big shows up and then he can shoot it, right? I, that's the way I'm going to play this mission. I'm not expecting anything to turn up, but just in case... We're going to have him covered. Okay, let's start with Kicks because he's always the man that goes forwards. Uh, this looks clear. Is there, is there... Is there a... There's a spaceship. You can just, just see it in the fog. I'm not sure if you guys are going to be able to see it with the, uh, you know, the whole darkness rendered that, that YouTube does. Ugh, terrible. Uh, so let's get in there. It's, it's not a great place. Not great positioning, but it's going to have to do. Still not seeing anyone. That, that's fine. We can deal... Oh, no, go, go away. We can deal with that. Uh, heavies. You know what? I think I might just like run him up here. We're, we're definitely looking to cover some ground, I think. Um, get our way up there. Find out what's going on. Ace is not our next man. There we go. Wild child, you are the person I want to send up here. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. To the very edge of our dash abilities. What could go wrong, hey? There's only six people out there. This is literally... A 1v1 scenario. For every soldier I have, they have a soldier. Which should be relatively easy to deal with. You know, we normally, we're normally we out, normally outgunned here. Um, like many people are looking down on us. That should be alright. Should be alright. Okay, let's, let's overwatch with the pistol. Uh, you are just going to overwatch there, though. I don't think it's going to be any use. And finally, we have our support officer who's just going to come and hide behind this little ledge here. Okay, awesome. Roger. Roger. Brilliant. I didn't realise Roger was on the squad, but those activities were short, weren't they? Are there people moving around or they're not? Um, okay, right. Let's start with this heavy. Not really anywhere for him to go straight off, though. We could just, like, dash up here. Seems like a plan to me. If we see stuff, then these two are there to back him up, but I don't think we're going to see anything for quite some time yet. Uh, kicks. Where are you going to go? Right here, we can start to see what, where we're actually going. Uh, I think I'm going to hide around the side of this wall. Start making my way up here. Uh, it seems like the plan to do. Uh, who's next? Wild child. Yeah, one of one of my elites. Let's get let's get you up here. This is good. This is good. Who else we got here? Okay, snipers definitely want to start making position up this way. Uh, I think here is a good place for him. And as he's on his pistol already, we can do deal with that as is. Brilliant. Uh, and then finally, well not finally yet, we've got this guy to want to deal with. Uh, I think just a dash up here. That's good. He, he's not there to be offensive, even though he is quite offensive really. Uh, he's, he's not there to deal with things like that. There we go. Uh, he's there almost entirely as backup. Now there's, there's bound to be a lot of stuff going on down this way, right? Bound to be. Let's, let's get both my snipers up together. Does mean that we could get taken out with one well placed grenade, but I think we'll deal with that. I think we'll deal with that. Let's overwatch everyone. All right. See what happens now. So that's the way we're. That's where we are. Well, how are we going to make our way in? This, this, always the the key. How are we going to make our way in? Uh, so let's start by yeah moving up snipers. I think just just here is good. Um, can we lob a battle scanner in there? I mean, that, that would be great. Just, just so we know what's going on on the inside. I, d I don't think there's going to be much going on in there. Oh, look at that. All right. All right. Okay. I like this. Where's my other sniper? Oh, he's too far away to be actually useful. Um, maybe we could put him somewhere more useful. I mean, that's a dash. That's also... Let's, let's try over here. Um, and, oh, we should have swapped him back to... There we go. Is, is that... Is that actually going to swap? Oh, geez, we, we triggered. I didn't mean to trigger. I didn't want to trigger. Oh, well. I suppose this is what we have to deal with. Uh, who have we got? We've got a heavy here. No, we are. We've got... 
Uh, oh god, this is Wild Child with her alloy cannon. Not so great on the... Um, what's the word I'm looking for? Range. Not so great on the range. Maybe we can move this guy up a little bit. Though that's also not great. Perhaps what we actually want is one of these. Um, if we could go down and in. Ah, uh, no. You can't tell me this is as far as we can go, is it? Ah, uh, okay. Well, what's the mine fry like? That's 100%. What's the, the mine control? Should we should we go with this? Let's try it. Let's see what's going to happen. If we, if we get to have a go with him, that'd be great. Yeah, look at that. We're just going to leave him there, see what happens. Like, we might have something useful. Right, the uh, support officer. He can come up here to this point of cover. What What's he doing? No, no, come on. Seriously? Seriously? What's this about? <clears throat> As always, worried about the... Let's put them on Overwatch. He's a bit useless back there. As always, we're worried about the ethereal more than anything. Uh, kicks. You can come down to... Oh, look. Half cover, half cover. It'd be great to get down there. Um... Let's, let, let's, let's do that next round. So we'll, we'll move in here. Hopefully get a shot. No, we ain't got no shots. That's fine. Okay, that's fine. We're going to move this one here. And then we're going to overwatch. And that should be everyone's go, I think. I was a little bit disjointed, that go there. Sorry about that. Um, I had trouble following it. I don't know about you guys. Uh, we got some overwatches on the go, though. This should be good. Pow. Did we get any hits? No, we didn't get any hits. No I know. No way, man. What is this? Uh, the Berserker coming forward, though. This should be good. Mutons all around. I'm really hoping we can get... Hey, man. Do you, do you mind? Do you mind? Let's see what's going to happen with this guy. He's psychic blasting my, my, my guy. That's, that's rubbish. Why would you do that? Okay, so he can see other stuff. But can this guy see... Yes, he can. 75% hit chance. We're going to go with the long range, like, uber hit. The, always the thing we need to try and take out first. Yeah, just like that. Just like that. Um, what else can we do? No no in the zone, nothing like that. Uh, do we want to... Oh, telekinetic field, that's no good. We could take him out. 95% hit chance. Um, hopefully this is going to be a takeout. It's a shame we couldn't get at him. It's a real shame we couldn't get at him. But, you know, that's the way of things. Is he going to move forwards? I hope he does, because then... Um, Wild child, the, the the person with the shotgun can have a pop. Oh, but we do get a double tap, so let's just do that, shall we? Maybe we'll, maybe we'll move him even closer. That'd be great. Oh, one one shot. Mm, 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 not sure what we're gonna do with that. I mean, do I want to waste my al alloy cannon shot on that? I kind of do. I kind of do. Uh, is that it? Are we done? Uh, Kobayashi, we don't we don't want you. But where is our support officer? You are the guy that's gonna come in and help out here. Um, oh, they're all dashes. They're all dashes. So like, where can we get and still have a relatively good shot chance? Nah, I just put him on the wrong side of that, didn't I? Oh well, that's a shame. But hopefully, 74% hit chance will be the one. Oh my gosh. Damn it. Yeah, damn it indeed. All right, let's just use this guy. This should be it. Hopefully. Oh. Yeah, we should keep start keeping score. And Kicks is going to come down here in the hope that someone flushes themselves out. I think, I think that's kind of the way it's going to be. Is that everybody? Oh, well, look, we've got a heavy back here. Um, we're going to move him. Hmm, where are we going to move him? Uh, we're going to move him here for now. There's not really much else we can do. It's kind of going to have to do. All right. Let's see what let's see what comes out. Well, here comes the floaters. Double floaters. Okay. Uh, is that what I predicted? I can't remember off the top of my head now. Um... But we're going to see what happens when these guys all fire off. No, no destruction of uh, of cover. It's a little bit of a shame. It's a little bit of a shame. No, nothing really to worry about, though. Much more worried about... Oh, suppressed, eh? You suppressing me? Uh, what he is going to do is definitely um, one of my major concerns. Is he just walking forward a little bit? Is he controlling my guy? That's no good. That's no good. Thankfully, someone here is going to have sight on the person. There we go. Look at this. So let's let's try that one. 74. It's not a great hit chance, but we're going to see. Right. That was my big big move for this round. That was definitely the thing that had to happen. I'm now super interested to know where the kicks get to go. Doesn't look like he does. That's a shame. That is a shame. Okay, who can this person fire at? 51%. Do you think we should run and gun ourselves to a slightly better position? Like, there's no one in it now, right? 
Uh, wait, hang about. How many have we fought? We've taken out a Berserker, an Elite, this guy over here, and then two Floaters. Uh, I don't think that's enough. I think there's one more around somewhere. There is definitely one more around somewhere. Okay, well, let's... Where is a good place to go cover myself? You know what? I think, I think I'm going to run and gun. This is, this is going to be super dangerous if it doesn't work. But I'm running down to here. No one's overwatched, which is good. And then we are going to rapid fire at this guy. Boom. Okay, I only need the one. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, so what have we got here? We've got a guy who's going to take out a floater. Oh, no. Yeah, we're going to take out a floater. Going to see if we can mind control him. That's always the best way to take, them, take care of people, right? Uh, and then there should be another one somewhere. Anyone know where he is? Like he's over here somewhere? I don't know. All right. Kicks can't do anything. I don't know why he's giving me his controls. Uh, collateral is going to come in this way. There's not, not, not much else we can do. He's got sights on someone. Who is it? Over there, 55. All right, take a shot. All right. Commander, the operation that was the whole mission. Success. Oh, my God, how quick was that? That was great. All right, let's do it, guys. And, and, and... And because it was a UFO, we should have some Illyrium. And then we can make some Psy Armor. And then we can press the button. Though I don't think we're going to press the button this round. We will press the button next episode. But, whoa! So excited. You might be out of town. I am so excited. Look at this. Clean board. Clean board. Um, and we've got some extra stuff. Oh my. Extra, extra stuff. I mean, do we... Uh, 13 Illyrium. Brilliant. Brilliant. Do we... Oh, now we've got to think about the squad squad composition and stuff like this. But before we do that, let's go to engineering. Go into build items. There we go. Do it. Do it. Yes. Booyah. I wonder how much we're short of doing another uh, blaster launcher. Taking in two of those would be great, right? We're, we're short quite a lot, and I'm not going to wait around for that. But... I think, in fact, yeah, with that, I'm going to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, guys. I will see you next time when we're going to put the psionic armor on one of our highly trained psionic operatives. And we are going to push that button and find out what it does. I will see you then when we're going to do that. Bye!